at River Park Square, you know. Gonna get our ice skating on. Personally, I've never been ice skating, but how hard could it be? Personally, I've been ice skating, but I was like five years I'm old. I'm looking in the so. viewfinder. I Me too. Do that. So, yeah, this is the start of our weekend vlog, and my twin is here with me, so hope you like her presents. <laughs> this is Hannah's boyfriend. His name's I'm James. Totally Funny thing, he's Aiden's best friend. He's more important to me than he is to her. And they were both Not in our real. wedding, but uh, we hooked them up, so now they're together. Okay, so we made it here, and it's extremely packed, like, of course. Like look. And we haven't gone ice skating in years, so we're gonna be those annoying people with like the wobbly legs and <laughs> stuff. But we're getting food and then we're gonna go ice skating and then I think we might go on the sky ride. It's like this little bubble that you go in across the city. <laughs> and so. your girl's afraid of heights, so let's see how this works. We went on one um, in Switzerland going down, what was the mountain? The Alps? Uh, no. I thought it was the Alps. I don't know. Well, we went to, we went down one in Switzerland. And there was so many people. And it was packed like sardines, but thought we were gonna snap it and it was yeah. gonna fall. And you might see a video of me crashing and burning on the ice because I've only been rollerblading once. I've been ice skating before, but I was literally like an infant, so we'll see how it goes. I thought when you said that you had been ice skating before, it was like recent. No, it was like years ago. I was like less than 10. Okay, yeah. well that doesn't count. <laughs> you literally got chocolate all over. Oh, it's on me. Embarrassing. Here we go, guys. We're going on one I'm of not, these. I'm not going with any strangers. There you are. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> There's four. Four? If you'd go to the middle one, please. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Eek! <gasps> it moves. <laughs> are you scared yet? Welcome to the sky ride. This will take 15 or 20 minutes. It'll take you down across the Spokane River, under the Monroe Street Bridge, and bring you safely right back here. Okay. Right. Enjoy your ride. Thank you. Safely defined. <laughs> <laughs> this vlog may never come out. I know. Oh. I might never draw because we're gonna draw. We're gonna draw. <laughs> <laughs> Hannah is already having a panic attack. <laughs> Hannah, we've been on one of these before. <laughs> Oh, it's kind of cool up here. It's not that high. Oh my God. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I think you would still die if you fell from oh, this, duh. From this high. Oh, duh. I skull open. Ooh, it's pretty though. If I just look at the camera, I feel a little bit better because. Yeah. You cannot get that all out. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we have our skates oh, on yeah. and we're horrified. <laughs> so scared. I've never been ice skating. But I'm standing and I'm not falling. So okay, bad. but we're not on the ice yet. Ooh. I got a size that's a little bit too big too. So like my feet aren't snug. Our feet. Yeah. Cubie. I'm shaking in my boots. Well, it looks like I'm the only successful skater here. It's not that bad, but Corinne is being dragged along. Hannah is struggling back here somewhere. How you doing? There's like a hill on this ribbon. Uphill, downhill. Uphill's kind of hard. I'm just being carried. So pretty successful here. 
<laughs> hanging off my honey. It's so fun. I love it, especially at night because all the lights are out. Yeah, once you get used to it, it's not bad. It's just it's really crowded. My sister is struggling hardcore. We passed her like hardcore. three times in one lap. Ooh. Okay, so story of Corinne's life. We just got coffee from the Nordstrom Cafe and she very specifically said Corinne, but the barista calls me Connie. Connie? Connie. Your peppermint hot cocoa's ready. Connie. It's like, come on. Okay, so we just got home from Christmas Eve service, which was so awesome. I've never been to a better Christmas Eve service ever. Like, it was amazing, and I'm on photography team, so I was taking a bunch of pictures, which was really fun. But right now, Aiden is literally wrapping my Christmas Eve pajamas that I'm gonna open immediately after he wraps, which is hilarious, but we're starting the tradition. I know everyone in the world has this, but give each other Christmas Eve PJs every single Christmas Eve. I've done this my entire life, so I thought I would bring this tradition into my family as well. And then the dogs are each gonna get one Christmas Eve gift as well. So we have a huge toy box for our puppies. And they're gonna get a Christmas gift boog. Be patient. I don't want one to give yet. Hmm. Castile, get your head out. Maybe we should do these. Okay. These are big Christmas Eve gifts though. No boog. Hey! Okay, come on. need to sit. You need to take the tags off of them. I will. Sit, puppies. I gotta pull the tag off first, okay? They're so happy. Look at them. You get Merry Christmas presents. Of course he wants the one that Pastel has. Wait, you guys want to switch? Oh, they wanted to switch the toys. We got dressed in our Christmas PJs. Aiden, you need to come here. Look how cute. Oh, did you hear that? Aiden just smashed. 
his hand so hard. He's ripping a tag off and it came off all at once. Anyways, as I was saying, look how cute this is. I'm a nanny, so I'm gonna be able to wear this sweater like at work. So pretty much, I, I can pick out the best outfit ever because Corinne looks so cute in her outfit. I'll give you an up close because they're little alpacas. Okay, one thing about me is I love cheesy pajamas. Like I have Cookie Monster pajamas, Monster Ink pajamas, Hello Kitty pajamas. Like I have like the craziest, cheesiest pajamas because I love them because it's like no one's gonna see you. It's just you at home. So why not wear something fun? So he knew that about me and picked out these cute little pants. And Aiden's cute little joggers that he could wear anywhere. They're so soft and cute. Oh my gosh, I wish you guys could feel how soft these are. We got both of our PJs at Nordstrom Rack. Nordstrom Rack is a place to go if you have one in your city, like. It really is. It's more expensive, obviously, than like Ross, Marshalls, Home Goods. But you but pay what you get for. You yeah. get good quality products.